Lewis Hamilton reportedly wants to see the FIA take action after his heartbreak in Abu Dhabi, Lewis Hamilton faces an anxious wait on the outcome of the FIA investigation into what happened at the controversial Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. It's now been over a month since Max Verstappen stole the lead from Hamilton in dramatic fashion at the Yas Marina circuit to take his first world championship. Hamilton had been leading for the majority of the race before a safety car period filled with controversy ruined his title chances, Mercedes were left furious at race director Michael Mossy for his decision to allow the lap cars between Hamilton and Verstappen through before the final lap, Toto Wolff trudged off to his offices after the race to immediately lodge two appeals to the FIA, which were eventually rejected. Hamilton was gracious in defeat, congratulating his championship rival for an amazing job, but nothing else has been heard from the seven-time world champion with growing reports he could walk away from F1, Wolf admitted in the week after the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix that Hamilton was disillusioned and was uncertain whether the 37-year-old will continue in the sport. Reports this week stated that Hamilton will decide his future after the Abu Dhabi investigation. The FIA have now confirmed that their inquiry into the dramatic race is underway, but a final decision won't come until the middle of March. It's been confirmed that the outcome of the investigation will not be announced until after both preseason tests. That may cause some further anguish for Hamilton, who will likely need to make a decision before the Barcelona test, which starts on February 23. The FIA statement read, following the decision of the World Motorsport Council in Paris on 15 December 2021, the FIA administration, under the leadership of Mohamed bin Sulaim, has started the detailed analysis of the events of the last Formula One Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. The FIA president launched a consultation with all F1 teams on various issues, including this one. On January 19, an item on the agenda of the Sporting Advisory Committee will be dedicated to the use of the safety car. The following stage will be a shared discussion with all F1 drivers. The outcome of the detailed analysis will be presented to the F1 Commission in February and final decisions will be announced at the World Motorsport Council in Bahrain on 18 March.